Hey you guys, this is Sierra Sheree, and if you're watching this video right now, I just want to say welcome to 2014, Happy New Year's, um, thank you guys for watching my video. Also, if you're watching this video, that means that I have passed my one year mark on SierraSheree.com, so I'm very happy and excited about that because it's just a stepping stone and it lets me know that you can do anything that you put your mind to. And if you really, really want to do something, step out on a limb and do it because starting my own website was just an idea. But now I, now it's up and running and it's been a year and who knows where things will go with it. But right now, everything is going good. I'm always getting good comments and good feedback and just love and support from my family, friends, and from random people that I don't even that I don't even know. So it's it's just a um it's just proof that you can do anything that you put your mind to. And I know it sounds cliche. I say this all the time. If you if you got an idea that you're thinking about or something that you've been wanting to do, kind of getting in your own way and you, you want to do it but you don't know, you kind of iffy about it. You don't want people to judge you or you don't you, you don't want to be a failure like what do you have to lose like what do you have to lose like I mean I can understand sometimes you have money if you invest in money in something you can lose your money or something like that I'm not saying be stupid and make dumb decisions and just jump into something without planning and thinking it out ahead but if it's something that you really want to do do your research and figure out what you have to do to do it. Because while you're sitting there thinking about it, it's somebody else out there that's already doing it. Or somebody else out there that's already on their path to doing it. So what are you waiting for? Like, life is too short. Tomorrow is not promised. And that's what this video is about today. Um, it's going to be a recap from 2013. And it's also going to be a get your life real talk for 2014. So I'm going to just start off by talking about 2013. 2013 was a good year for me. I have a list of people that I want to give shout outs to and thank. Um, because I could not do anything that I'm doing alone. It might seem like it's a lot of work on my own part and it is I, it's a lot of stuff that i do planning um writing stuff filming editing it's a lot it's, it's a whole lot publishing it's a lot of stuff that i do and even though i have i wear many hats in what i do i could not be where i am i could not have done what i have done if it wasn't for the that have had my back, supported me, pushed me. Because sometimes when you want to start your own business or you want to just, you just want to do something different, you have doubts and you, you sometimes, like I get in your own way. Sometimes you're like, mm, I don't know if I can do that or I'm afraid to do that. And you need those people in your circle that motivate you and push you or give you the lift or that exposure or whatever it, whatever it is that you need to push you forward and I had a big big support system team family this past year and all of these people are people that I support just as much as they support me and it's love like for real it's really love like this video is very genuine I'm being very transparent and I might seem like real turned up in this video it's late at night and I really just wanted to put this video out and just really get some stuff off of my mind and let's go. So, um, some of the people that I want to thank, uh, first off, my mom, most importantly, she pushes me to do everything that I'm thinking about doing. She's, the, she's my go-to person whenever I'm thinking of a new idea or a venture. I'm, I talk to her about it first and she never 
she never discourages me or tells me you can't do that or you aiming too high. She always motivates me and lets me know that you can do it and it's possible. Also, mom, you know, always got my back. Sometimes she even films my videos. Sometimes when I got a lot of stuff going on at one time, she films for me, you know. So shout out to mom, super mom. Kaya, Lexi, like my two role dolls, best friends. Sisters, they like sisters to me, you know, they got that link sierra.com in their uh, bios on Instagram and all that good stuff And if it wasn't for y'all, I would, yeah, and I said y'all, I'm country If it wasn't for y'all, I wouldn't be able to have as many views as I have I know people sometimes just go on their Instagrams and stuff just to check their pictures out And they got my link in their page, like they don't have stuff going on in their own life, you know So I appreciate that, that's love And I always will have y'all back because y'all had mine Amber Mason, I'm just, I'm just, it's just getting random now Amber Mason, um, she contacted me about doing an interview with LSU Reveille last year and I did an interview about, you know, fashion and all that stuff and she, you know, pushed and got my link to my website in the Reveille, which is the LSU newspaper. So that was a big deal for me. Thank you, Amber Mason, who is a reporter writer for the LSU Reveille. Shout out to you because that, you know, I'm sure got me more, you know, views on my page. So if it wasn't for you, I appreciate you reaching out to me. You know, obviously letting me you know, you know, it makes me feel good. It's like, okay, I'm doing something where I'm credible, where she wants to interview me about fashion. And then she gave me my website and my brand a shout out. So thank you. NAACP at LSU, shout out to you for asking me to do um, Entrepreneur Night. Thank you. That was a big deal for me. That was my first time speaking about my brand in front of people and I was nervous, but it went good. I appreciate that opportunity. So shout out to LSU NAACP, National Association for the Advancement of Colored People, um, and Myron Smothers, Jigging Like Myron. Uh, speak that I speak that real whatever you want to call him he was over at NAACP at that um, time and he contacted me about doing that so thank you for that highlight LSU shout out to the hot spot I appreciate you guys putting me on your show and interviewing me to talk about my website and my brand because um, highlight LSU like they had some big name people around the campus interviewed for that and for me to be amongst those people who had inter to get interviewed, you know, I'm amongst people who DJ, you know, for people, big name people and people who sing and got their own band and wrote books and I was asked to be interviewed amongst people like that. That was a big deal for me. So shout out to Myron of the Hot Spot again, the Hot Spot crew, Marlon who interviewed me and we had fun and you know it was just real down to earth, always down to earth. Marlon is good people. Shout out to him. The Rouge Collection, shout out to you guys. Big, big shout out to you guys. Um you guys have shot me. You guys gave me a push to look at myself in another light more of a model view letting me know that I can you know do more stuff like that if I wanted to I'm more the type to be behind the scenes when it comes to the industry type stuff but I had fun modeling with the Rouge Collection I love the Rouge Collection that is my family they gave me uh they gave me inf infinite um opportunities with them um they even i wrote my first article for the rouge collection um it was called what was it called how to be one of the greats and um that was an article that i just wrote it just came to me from out of thin air i wrote it and i gave it to them and they put it on their site so shout out to the rouge collection for always giving me opportunities like that and um, the Rouge Collection even gave me the opportunity to be on my first billboard which is a huge deal for me like seeing my face on the billboard like I was really really calm compared to how I felt on the inside when I saw the billboard 
like my inside like that made my year being on a billboard like what and then like off of by the interstate heading to LSU that was a big deal for me and I just want you guys to know that I really really love you guys for that because there are numerous girls who model for you and for you to have chose me as one of the girls to be on the billboard I really appreciate that and I love you guys like you guys don't even understand my face was in the sky on a big electronic billboard like my face I was just like wow it was so surreal and opportunities like that you know you just never it's, it's, it's never going to be forgotten so thank you V thank you for the opportunity that you gave me to model be one of your models um, in the slideshow that was um, done at a club downtown for um, Lee Trick the photographer I really appreciate you choosing me as one of your models because I know there's numerous girls who hair that you do and the fact that you chose me that was you know that that would meant a lot for me and now I have those pictures from when I modeled and they're on my site and you know they're very professional pictures thank you V I appreciate that um who is my stylist you guys so shout out to her it's time for me to go back to her um which i will do soon but shout out to the anyone that has ever said anything motivational to me my friends um denisha who is starting her own blog and it should be out well it's definitely going to be out by the time that i post this video and i will put the name to her blog i mean to her um blog on um here probably here um but um yeah shout out to d check out her blog because she has a lot of real to speak she's a very wise woman and i'm so glad that i have her as a friend because she also pushes me and her drive pushes me too because she was in my apartment the other day and she was sitting down on her computer working on her blog and i was just like dang you know i like to be around people that's determined like that and they have things going for themselves and they they're they're happy just as happy for me as i am for them you know they're always every time i'm doing something go you know go girl Oh, I see you. You know, I'm happy to have a support system like that around me. And that's the type of people that you need to keep around you. People that's building you up, not people that's breaking you down. So, shout out to D. Any other friends that I have that are always supporting me, pushing me, liking my videos, watching my videos, people who subscribe to my channel, people who have commented, people who have left um, sent me emails, people who ask me questions, all this stuff, like, people don't even know the half of some of the stuff I do. People that I don't even know, thank you, because that pushes me even more, because that lets me know that I'm kind of on another level now. Like, it, it kind of builds my self-esteem and my esteem just in fashion, blogging, vlogging, my website, my YouTube channel, it just builds my self-esteem all around because it's just kind of like okay i'm getting kind of not big or nothing like that but it's just i'm reaching people outside of my circle outside of baton rouge outside of louisiana outside of the united states i've had people who have contacted me from other countries so that means a lot to me because it's just kind of like dang i'm reaching somebody and as long as i'm helping somebody out my day is a-okay so I appreciate that. You guys don't even understand how much your comments like really mean to me when I get comments from you guys and and y'all are like, man, you know, you you know what you're doing, blah blah blah. Like I had somebody tell me today that I'm gonna be the next Joan Ambrose. That was a huge compliment to me. Like, wow, like you really think that like is is flattering. Last thing we want to talk about is 2014. Get your life in 2014. Tomorrow is not promised. Um, 2013, um, I lost one of my close friends. I never thought that he would have been gone like that. I found out in class it was a really tough time for me because I was just talking to him the night that he got killed. And it was a bit shy to me, but 
he always was a good person. He always pushed me. He always was like, we gonna make it. We gonna make it. You gonna make it. You gonna make it. He always pushed me and motivated me. So I, I'm here to motivate you guys to do what you have to do to get to where you need to go. Right now, it's the time. Like, tomorrow is not promised. I went to a funeral a few days ago in 2014. And 2014 just started. It's like the 6th. So... And that person died um, in 2013. Never would have probably thought, you know, you never know. You might, tomorrow is not promised. I never would have thought I would have went to a funeral this year. Like, I never would have thought that I would have been in a funeral, going to a funeral already. You know, the year just started. It's still January. But tomorrow is not promised. Like I said, just stay focused, you guys. Grind. Grind hard. Um, I have so many projects that I'm working on right now. I'm just so focused, like, can't nothing um, stop me. Um, just just keep, keep your circle full of people that support you and let them motivate you. If you have haters, let them motivate you too. If somebody's hating on you, don't let it bother you. Like, don't let it, let it push you. Let it be motivation. Because when people are hating on you, that's something that lets you know you're doing something good. And nine times out of ten, the people that are hating on you or sitting on their ass, not doing nothing. It's other words that I want to say, but I'm trying to keep it clean. Just hating for no reason. So let people hate. Let people talk. Let people be negative. Because at the end of the day, what Sierra Sheree does is Sierra Sheree's business. That's pushing her closer to her goals. And my YouTube videos are monetized. So anybody that dislikes, puts the thumb, thumbs down, on a video that comments negative t negatively or just does anything that they think is going to rock my world or knock me off my feet, try it because all you're doing is putting more money in my pocket at the end of the day. So, get your hustle. Get your hustle because 9 times out of 10 people that's hating and sitting on their ass not doing nothing anyway for their life. So, don't worry about haters. If you got something that you want to do, you want to be a rapper, you want to be a songstress, you want to be an artist, do something that's going to leave an impact on the world and make the world better or help someone out. Just do something that makes you happy at the end of the day. Even, uh, even talking to people that's hating, if someone is a hater, you're watching this video, you hate on people from time to time, get yourself in check. Get your life because... While you hating on people, they out here getting money. They out here making moves. They doing what they got to do to reach their dreams. But what are you doing? Sitting up there watching them and envying them when you could be doing your own hustle. You could be making money. You could be doing all the things that they're doing, but you too busy trying to knock the next man when they trying to work on what they doing. So, get your life. Thank you guys for watching my video. Much love and... I'm so excited for what 2014 has in store. Thank you.